back to my channel my name is Liz Shantae if you don't know now you know and since you know go ahead and hit the subscribe button so all the products that I'm using are going to be listed below inside the description box but I'm also going to tell you what I'm using what I'm using to prime my lips right now is the Milani 2-in-1 in the color 0910 and I just put a little bit there and just blend it all the way out I'm not setting and I'm going to show you guys why so I'm using the box of crayons palette and I'm using the pink first and since I did not set, I'm going to be patting the color onto my eyes first before I actually start blending it in. So I'm putting the pigment down and then blending. Next, I'm going to use the purple and I'm going to blend that into my crease. And since I have that pink down, I can go ahead and just start blending because it has a nice smooth base, I should say. <laughs> I wasn't really sure what type of look I was going for. I just know I wanted pink and purple, but I feel like I do a couple of pink and purple looks, so I just wanted something different. And I'm taking that black just to deepen up my crease some, just for a little dimension, and to just make my crease a little deeper. I feel like I already said that. <laughs> but yeah, I really wasn't sure what type of look I was going for. I just wanted to do something new. So I just threw something together, literally, and it just came out so beautiful. But right now I'm just cleaning that up and I'm taking that same concealer that I used to prime my lids to cut my crease. On top of that cut crease, I'm going to use some Ulta Beauty Glitter Primer and I'm just going to put that towards the inner corner of my eyes because that's where I want most of the pop to be. And then I'm going to go in with the Ulta Beauty glitter palette i'm not really sure the name of this it came inside a gift set box but i'm going to use the color called electric daisy it is just so pretty you guys i kind of had to pack it on but it just came out so nice in the end going back into the crayon box palette i'm going to use baby blue and that is going to be put on the center of my lids y'all i cannot talk today but yeah i'm putting that on the center of my lids and that blue is just so pretty it went on so smooth and I loved it. I don't know why, but I'm really loving blues right now. So, yeah, I just had to throw some blue in. <laughs> and now I'm taking purple, and that is going on the outer corner of my eyes and blending into that darker shade. So moving on to the face, I'm going to be using the Black Opal Oil Blocking Primer and the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. Y'all don't know why I use two primers. It's not really necessary, but I just love to do it. I'm not sure if it even makes a difference, but yeah, I like to use two primers. For foundation, I'm going to be using the Black Opal True Color Foundation in the color Hazelnut. And you guys, this is my favorite foundation right now. I just love how skin-like it is, and it's like the perfect shade for me. So yeah, this is my go-to right now. For both highlighting and contour, I'm going to be using the NYX HD Concealer. For highlighting, I'm going to use the shade Nutmeg, I believe. I also use the shade Nutmeg to color correct around my mouth, just so that my face can be an even tone. And for contouring, I'm using that same concealer, but in the shade Cappuccino.
To set my highlighted places, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade 30 Medium Deep. And I really like this powder. Um, since I bought it, I haven't stopped using it. <laughs> And to set my contour areas, I'm going to use this e.l.f. bronzer palette in the shade Bronze Beauty. Although this isn't a really deep bronzer, I feel like it gives me a nice skin-like bronze look. So I like it and it's super affordable, so it can't go wrong. Y'all, I've really been snatching my nose lately and I am living for it. <laughs> but going back into that palette, I'm taking Deep Plum and that is going to go on my bottom lash line just to pull everything together. I also went back into that baby blue and added that to the inner, inner corner of my eye just to have a little more of that blue and a little more pop. And for mascara, I'm using the Pretty Vogger mascara just on my bottom lashes and I applied falsies off camera. So yes, my eyes are finally done. For blush, as usual, I'm using my BH Cosmetics Blush Neutrals palette and I'm just mixing a few of those colors together. You guys know that I like my blush nice and subtle, nothing too popping or out there. To set my face, I'm using the Maybelline Master Fix Setting Spray and then I'm going to move on to highlighting. And to highlight my face, I'm just going to use that same glitter that I used on my eyes and it just gives me a nice galaxy look like I really love this shade. For my lips, I lined it with just a purple liner, a dark purple, and on top of that I used the LA Colors Matte Liquid Lip Color in the shade Fierce. And I was so like out of focus and off camera for this part, so I just edited all of that out. And then I put that same glitter on top of my lips, and that is the finished look, you guys. Super pretty, galaxy chick-like, like, I'm loving it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope you learned something, and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to subscribe, girl. Bye.